your Thursday. Escaping expectations, I, I, don't, I don't know if it's possible because they creep in, right? As subtle as being in a situation and having an expectation of a certain feeling, whether it's a good situation and you're sad and you feel sad, so you, you're, like, you're conflicted about, you know, this is, I should be happy. Even, even the use of the word I should has a connotation of expectation because there's the presumption of knowledge, the presumption of knowing how you are supposed to feel. I, I, I think it's interesting. Um, that takes us out of the present, right? If I think I know I'm supposed to feel a certain way when I get, get to this, you know, get married, I, you know, I, that just that statement, I feel like, yeah, when I get married, I should probably feel this way. I have expectation attached to that. And that can alter the experience, right? Doing our best, doing my best to just be present in a situation, I, there's a lot of times I don't know what I'm feeling or, yeah, I, or I don't know. And I don't know if that's right or wrong. It just is. Um, I know that I'm grateful to be present. I'm grateful to have like a baseline of serenity and I can feel anxious and a bit sad. And the whole of that, I don't, yeah, it's, I, I don't know. It's, it's interesting. <laughs> I, I keep saying it's interesting. Um, yeah. The subtle nature, the creeping in of expectation in everything we have in our lives. Yeah. The sneaky little foe expectation. I don't know. Just being, I, the more I get, just stay awake, be present, this moment, right here, right now, and breathe. Yeah, I don't know. Much love. <laughs>